Hey there, what's up, and welcome back to Autos Official, the channel where we bring you the latest updates on the hottest cars in the market. Today, we're taking a closer look at the 2023 BMW Mon 135i, the latest addition to BMW's M Performance lineup. As you can see, this car is a beauty. It's sleek, it's sporty, and it's loaded with features that are sure to impress any car enthusiast out there. Inside, you'll find a cockpit that's designed to give you the ultimate driving experience. From the sports seats to the digital instrument cluster, everything about this car screams performance. And speaking of performance, let's take a look under the hood. The 2023 BMW Mon 135i is powered by a turbocharged 2. 0-liter 4-cylinder engine that produces 302 horsepower and 332 lb of torque. And that's just the beginning. This car has so much more to offer, from its advanced suspension system to its cutting-edge technology. So buckle up and join me for a ride as we explore everything the 2023 BMW Mon 135i has to offer. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. The BMW Mon 135i X-Drive is a hot hatch that needed some revisions and BMW claims to have addressed the issues that plagued the previous model. But does it deliver on its promise? Let's find out. The Mon 135i is quick enough, thanks to its 306 horsepower 2, 0 liter turbocharged engine. But the engine still lacks emotional engagement and doesn't sound very inspiring. And while the gearbox is okay in manual mode, it can be jerky and grabby in slow moving traffic. However, the interior is a strong point for the Mon 135i. It's not top class but the materials are decent and the fixtures and fittings are top-end for this class. The iDrive controller is also easy to use, and the car comes with lots of simple buttons that cover all the bases. But what about the driving experience? Unfortunately, the steering has zero feel, and the torque steer can be a problem. However, the Mon 135i carries plenty of mid-corner speed, and the mechanical front differential and activated rear axle help to quell understeer. The standard car comes with passive M Sport suspension, but the car we tested came with adaptive dampers. The ride is firm, but not unbearable. However, there's a perception that a sporty car has to be firm, and that's not always the case. Overall, the BMW Mon 135i X-Drive is a mixed bag. It's quick, but not emotional. The interior is nice, but the driving experience is lacking. If you're in the market for a hot hatch, there are better options out there. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more car reviews and automotive content.